Okay, it is February 9th, 2022, 3.47 p.m. This is episode 1,546. Um, Eileen Gu is an American. She was born in the United States of America. Her mother is Ch Chinese nationalist. Her father is an American. And she's the, and she's the best skier in the world, probably. And uh, she's not one of those people that, that could not make the U.S. team. She's predicted to like bring home a bucket full of gold medals. Um, but she's not going to compete for, for the U.S. She's competing for China. She's already won one gold medal that I'm aware of at this time. I haven't watched the Olympics today. But, um, yeah, so there's a lot of criticism about this. It's like, why are you doing this for China? Um, and at the same time, I'm thinking of all these Republicans who are basically competing for Russia, that, that they're cheerleading Russia on. Um, there's a huge faction of the Republican Party. Tucker Carlson's a part of it. And so are others at Fox News where they're just cheering for Russia. Now, this cartoon is kind of hard for me to uh, get the elephant right where I want him with this angle and to get the skier where I want her. Um, and then I had trouble with the, not some trouble, but just, well, yeah, I had some trouble with the, the crowd because I didn't want the crowd to stand out too much. I didn't want them to mesh with my main two characters in this cartoon. So I wanted to make them faint, but I still wanted them to have some detail. I didn't want to just draw a bunch of circles. And Lalo Alcarez, one of my colleagues, he gave me a compliment uh, on the crowd on, on Twitter. And I really appreciated that. Cartoonists hate drawing crowds, so cartoonists notice whenever somebody puts a lot of work into a crowd. Uh, not just usually a bunch of heads and stuff. Now, a lot of times, I'm not criticizing cartoonists who just draw a bunch of circles, you know, for a crowd. Because sometimes I think that looks awesome. Uh, it depends on the cartoons, on, on who the person is. Uh, I, I want to pull out Matt Davies' name again. Sometimes I've seen him draw a crowd like that, and I think it looks great. Uh, it, it blends in with everything that he's doing. He's a much better artist than I am, and I love his work. Uh, but but then he, he won't put as much detail into the crowd like I would hear. And this is one of my lazier crowds, but I still think it would come out. His version or his crowd would come out great. And I'm using him as an example because there's several others who I believe do that. And then there's a few guys who do it, and I just like that just doesn't look good at all. <laughs> and I'm not going to say their names. Actually, I can't think of any at the moment. Uh, so, oh, crowds, crowds, crowds. And I'm glad I drew this last night. I drew, yeah, the crowd and all of it last night. Just some little bit more sketching this morning before I colored. So, uh, because I had too many beers last night. Um, so I was really glad about that. Woke up about seven here, and I finished that. I'm I'll be on a plane at one, and I'm really looking forward to going home. But I'm not looking forward to the flight. <laughs> to the flights plural, because they're they are really cramped. Um, they were, and uh, they're both long flights. Well, the second one is not. The first one for me today won't be that long. It's like an hour and a half, I guess. But even that for me, just being cramped is just it sucks. And but the one after that is like three hours, three and a half maybe. And from Denver to Washington, and that's just crap, three hours. And, and you kind of nod off a little bit, but but kind of like you're in that, that place between being awake and sleep. So it's not really there. You're just sitting straight up. You can't lean back, nothing like that. If you're next to the window, you can lean your head against the wall of the airplane. But other passengers don't like it when you lean your head against them. So um, anyway, <laughs> I don't recommend that. Everybody, and I'm not going to listen to that. Cheryl Crow song when I'm leaving Las Vegas today. So everybody have a good day. Uh, and I'll next time you hear from me, it will be from Virginia, I think. Bye. Talk on, talk on.